It looked like a crowbar. I was wondering how a kilo was gonna get, how a kilo is gonna stay here while I did an MLV. Look at this place, look how gorgeous this is. It's the van, consensual sex van. There was either a bunch of deer or antelope right over there. There's trails here. I was gonna go up into those rocks, but Akila was not having me leave him. Like, we stick, we're staying together. <sighs> Vacation. Had a, uh, I got stung by a bee and had an allergic reaction. Which I've never had before. We're gonna have a uh, hurricane. Actually, I'm wondering how to get that uh, crowbar out of the ground. I think a kilo being eventually will work it out of there. Had an allergic reaction to a bee sting. My eyes starting to swell up. Basically, any place where I've had a bad sting or a bite um, is swelling and itchy, like all over my whole body. I remember when I got bit on the eye. I think it was a spider in Australia. It was like in 2000. And I heard of that happening. When you get allergic to things, you have like, like almost like the history of your bites uh, comes to the surface. Anyway, this trip's been fantastic. I left early because yeah, I was not feeling good, so I took half a day off and um, hit the road. Powered all the way through Oregon uh, in an afternoon. I think I drove for like six and a half hours or seven hours. Uh, this is the uh, the first national fo national forest I got to entering uh, California. And it's already 7 o'clock at night, so, or 7 o'clock in the evening, so it's time to stop. This camera probably doesn't do it justice, but this place is amazing. It's a pathway that leads through the cut up there. I went up through there, and, like, grassy fields, like, like well, that kind of grass, like that tall, um, bright green plants. Ah. Uh, Heading down to South Lake Tahoe to see the lovely Amanda again. Uh, it's only been a month since I've seen her. Very excited to do it again. Actually, this has been like great practice. My idea about like my future self, how I'm going to entertain myself, which would be traveling and traveling by the cheap and traveling with dog. Uh, I actually just right up the road here is the uh, uh, what do they call it? The internment camp. Um, uh, I can't remember what they call that. Uh, internment camp. But that was interesting to see, like this, uh, like in in some ways it looks like a cute little neighborhood. And I see all these like Asian families gathered together and tons and tons of kids playing from all around the country meeting each other. Um, this weird kind of like, it's a grand adventure uh, combined with this displacement of human beings based on uh, country of origin. Uh, would I have done it if I was in charge of things? No, I think the whole idea of like, in some cases I really think that waiting, to some, waiting till something goes wrong uh, and fixing it is the way to go about it. Like trying to meet trouble halfway or going all the way to try to meet trouble just seems to me to cause trouble. What else? Uh, I want to, like, there's a bunch of lava uh, areas that come through here. Not lava, like old, old lava fields is what I mean. And uh, I really want to go, I Google earthed uh, some of those lava fields and there's parts where like the lava comes flowing through here, right? But then it hits this kind of like uh, small, you know, incline and then flows around it. So these little islands that I just, you know, like I'm fascinated by the idea of a little island been growing forever and uh, surrounded by uh, old lava. I wish I could let a kilo off the leash. Oh, you hooked up, bud? All right, hold on. You, 
up. Come on. Why don't you settle down, the baby? This is why I wanted to leave you behind. Okay, go. Lift. There you go. Oh, that's why I wanted to leave you in the van. You weren't having it. Now I gotta, now I gotta watch Aquila. Make sure the antelope, the antelope or whatever those are don't come back. Traveling with a dog, I think that, uh, look, look I did the can. That's I got, I got powerful thighs, that's how that happened. Traveling with a dog is a kind of a mixed blessing. Um, I was thinking about like how great it would be to come bombing down here on a motorbike. But also, like, why else would I stop every two hours and get out and let Aquila run around? Uh, uh. Oh, buddy. Oh, man. Well, I think I'm just gonna I'm just gonna try to pry that crowbar loose, and uh, maybe I'll send it to Crazy Matt. You can make me a sword out of it. I'll take my time on the rest of this. I might walk around. I might explore a little bit. Why not?